let's get started my name is Mtwana hey uh, after we finish this you're gonna be able to solve not only that question we're gonna be able to solve this question right here this question right here and this question right here within 10 minutes okay so follow me now let's get started so let's start to the first question right uh, which one should I start with let's start to the first one but I'll go fast okay hey face before I get started hey follow me on Instagram you can see the program we have we feed in the home right we feed our brother and sister right see and it's not only feeding them equip them with the skills coding skills inspiration and talk to them and you know uplift one another so we restore the heart so go to my instagram mtwana underscore wabantu with a small letter mtwana underscore wabantu or if you cannot get the just say mtwana leave a space in between underscore wabantu or say mtwana space wabantu you gonna get me you gonna see me there right okay also if you have any query you can direct message me you can feel free to direct message me only for serious business people okay only for serious business or you can email me mtwana wabantu at gmail.com that's my email address hey without father june let's get started right so let's solve those questions huh huh i'm ready for that now we go we say look they say aziz is planning to attend a college when she graduates from the high school four years from now so what time number of years it could fall okay she has made arrangement with her father to donate the house so she's gonna be doing some house call like doing some stuff at home task or whatever and the dad is gonna put some money and the dad is gonna deposit this amount at the end of every six months so in mathematics especially financial math pay attention to this every every only word every or each every means either that word every or each certain period of time if you deposit fixed amount of money if you deposit certain amount for certain period of time which is fixed time let's say after one week or after every year or after every week then you know a that can apply present formula present formula or can apply future value formula present value formula future so now i'm gonna know whether it's gonna be present value formula future value formula. let's continue reading so now the amount that a debt is gonna deposit is gonna be x we call it x x that fixed the amount which is gonna be three five seven okay now they say the county pay interest rate what is the interest rate equal to 8.5 percent but it was compounded semi-annual so you take this interest you divide it by how it was compounded it was compounded semi-annual what is the semi semi meaning two means in every year it's gonna be it's gonna be compounded this interest semi-annual hey look sometimes so this is for now the gift to us but hey the question that always changes they're not going to give to you all the same thing every time okay they're going to be changing for example they might say it was compounded uh every month means you're going to say i ah, equal to 8.5 over 8.5 percent over they say monthly so how many months in one year they're 12 so divided by 12 instead of two if they say it was compounded let's say it was compounded let's say uh daily daily how many days in one year they're 365 days so for that case i was going to divide by 365 days if it was compounded daily it was compounded quarterly or quarter we say okay 8.5 percent divided by four because we have a four quarter in one year is three months three months three months so now hey let's get back to our bill that was not part of the equation the question for now it was compounded it was compounded what semi-annual there are two half in one year so her father pays additional debt on top this amount so this amount the daddy decided you know what i want my baby to go to school so for every amount i was depositing i'm gonna add her daddy pays addition of that one for every this amount so we're gonna add by five 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 zero so this is gonna give us a total of 9120 together so this is the amount the debt is gonna be deposited for every for every one for every six months now who do the one now they say uh the face deposit will be made after every six months from now how much money will there in account when aziz had paid for her college so it means at first when you started this question we don't know whether it's going to be future value or present value i uh, wouldn't have uh, so now we're looking for that future amount that dead uh aziz is going to pay or dead is going to pay for her so future value formula we got future value formula say future value equal to x and then we say one bracket plus interest rate but interest rate must be divided by m like you see oh my god okay, okay let me do this is it that 
which is, this is the open trade here. So this interest, which is 8.5 divided by n, m is like how it was compared, which was 2. Now, and the power m, n, and then you minus 1, you close the bracket, and then make sure you must take i over m at the bottom. So now we have everything, we can plug it and get the answer. So we're going to say now our future value we're looking for. Equal, our future value we're looking for. Equal, x, we have x, oh, of course yes, 91. 20, 20, bracket, bracket, because we follow this one. X is 91, 20. Okay, one is one bracket, one plus. Interest rate, interest rate equal to 8.5, and our M, M equal to two. For a percent here. Or well, if you don't want to write percent there, you can do this, right? You can take this 100 to the bottom. It means you, if you don't want to do it, you can remove that percent and then write 100 to the bottom. You see, two times 100, eight of the two. Okay? M times N, M times N, what is it? M? M equal to 2 times N, number of years, so it's going to be 2 times 8, or you can say 2 times 4. But we're not equal to 8, no problem, minus 1, minus 1, bracket, bracket, close, and then you over, over, I over M, 8.5. So you can write like here how you work, or if you don't want to say 8.5, it depends on your calculator, or how you want over 2. Or you can say 8.5 over 2 times 100. 100 can go to the bottom. So either way, I'm just showing you double way so you can see which are you, you're comfortable with. So present value, future value means, sorry, that that is going to pay for her beautiful baby equal to, come to the calculator, let's plug in the calculator real quick here. So we come here, say fraction, fraction. Now we're going to 91, 91, 91, 20, 91, 20. And the bracket, bracket. One bracket, second bracket. And they say 1, 1, plus, plus. Fraction, 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 this is 8.5, 80.5, shifting, bracket, okay, shift the bracket, and let's go to the bottom, come to the bottom here, 2 times 100, 2 times 100, 200, oh, no, 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 if I put percent on top there, then I don't have to say 8 times 100, I can just put 2, you see what I'm saying, look how they did, right, so you can say 8.5 percent, if you put percent on top, at the bottom, do not multiply by 100, if you don't put percent on top, means I mean here, see, if you don't put the percent there, then you put 2 times 100. But for now, since I put percent there, then they can just say what? 2. Okay, now, come here, and then you close the bracket, and they say this could be power, and then 4 times 3 equal to 8, and then 8, and then we minus 1, excuse me, now you close the bracket. No, 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 no we don't close there. Come here, come here, come here. Okay, go to the right, and then minus 1, Close the bracket. Okay, close the bracket. Go to the bottom. Fraction 8.5. 80. Point 5. Let's say now I don't want to put percent to top. If I don't want to put percent to top, I can say 3. Come and say that 2. And then multiply by 100. So 8 of the two ways. Okay, don't forget. I think you understand. But if you put percent to top, do not put the 100 at the bottom. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, close, close. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, whoa, whoa. Close here. Okay, so this is going to give us the option number one. So for the question, question number one, it's going to give you the option about come, come, come. Okay, option number one. Because if approximate nine is going to make it work, uh, it's going to be 86. Because uh, 85 nine nine. So nine is going to change that five to become six. So the closest answer is the option number one. Let's go to the question number two. So for this one here, it's going to be option number one. Let's highlight it. Oh, man, I didn't see. Okay, so this is going to be what? Answer here. Let's go to question number two. So question number two. They say Karen, you can say Karen, Karen, or Karen, it depends on your language, how you talk, okay? Now, let's say this man here has a three million point da 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 stand for his retirement, so he already has the money. So, there's a chance that we could use a present value formula, but let's read, because for us to use a present value formula, we must have that every, every, let's see if we have. If we don't have that, then it cannot be present value or future value, okay? Now, so we must have that word every, and then you know it can be present or future. But if you don't have that, then don't apply that formula. Maybe it's going to be normal compound formula. So we say, well, we have the amount. So we don't know what this carbon has. Oh, so we have the present value. Equal to 3 million, 1, 2, 3, 6, 5. And then what happened? Save for his time. His account in. Oh, so we got interested. What is interest Interested equal to 8 point for what? Percent. Okay, per annum, compounded half year. Oh, come on, half year. So the half year, how many half in one year? Two. So we're going to buy. By two. Now, if you want to be able to withdraw 
amount for 15 years also number of years equal to 15 the final withdrawal will start after six months the final with all is going to start after six months okay how it was compounded it was compound okay now what do the one look they see at the end of every six months so now we don't have that amount which is at the end of every six months which will present using a letter x we don't have that amount which you're looking for now they even say here the withdrawal will start on the six months now what do they want how much will be able to withdraw at the end of every six months that amount you which you do at the end of every time we represent use letter x which we don't have now they want that amount so i'm going to say now let's put a formula here so we know it's going to be present value so present value formula say uh present value equal to x x bracket one minus one plus interest rate over m now here is going to be minus for present value m n and then you close the bracket then you over always i over m so you can plug it so present value we got present value for now we have a present value so we have a present value what is the present value we have equal to that one the minimum so we're we'll gonna say three million means one two three six five three million three thousand six six hundred okay equal to x what is x we don't know we're looking for this now okay now let me do like this so we're not gonna okay let me do that. so we're not gonna close the drama here okay let's do like this okay now one is one minus minus bracket bracket one plus one plus what is the interest rate 8.4 percent or if you don't want to write percent there i can say over like i say you gotta use it i can say m what is the m our m equal to two but i multiply by 100 if you don't want to write percent here then i can say 100 two times 100 equal to 200 bracket bracket negative negative what is the m our m equal to 15 and what is our 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 m equal to two and n equal to 15, which you multiply, you're gonna get equal to 30. Bracket close, close, close over i over m. So you can say 8.4 percent. Let, let me write percent now over m. What is m? m equal to 2. Okay, so it can be anyway. So now we want to get the value of x. Let me plug all of this in the calculator. When you plug all that in the calculator, it's gonna give you, uh, let's plug, it's gonna give you 16.37. Let's plug some people know how to plug it. Okay, so we come in a fraction, close and they say okay, fraction, fraction. Now we see uh how many bracket there? One, one, excuse me, bracket, 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 bracket. This is one, one, and then we plus with plus, and they say okay, fraction, fraction, 8.4, 80 point oh shifty percent, shifty percent, and they go to the bottom, go to the bottom. So if you write percent, I can just say two, I don't have to write hundred. You understand what I'm saying? Close, close because I want percent on top, and then we we'll go there. We we'll go power, power, negative, negative, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, close, close, and then we come here. We close, yeah, yeah, okay. Now we come there, 8.4, 30, 4, shift, percent over 2, over 2. Come here, and then you close close the close okay let's get out so when you plug that one in the calculator all that the one aside we're gonna give a 16 point 89 97 for okay cool so we got that one so what we're gonna do now we're gonna take this amount is this amount here and then divide by all of this okay so that's gonna give us that but let me show you how we did we do we do that so now look so all this amount we know the value so we're gonna say now three okay look this is gonna be three okay this is gonna be three uh, three double zero three six fifty x equal to x and all of this amount what is this amount this amount we say we got equal to we have wrong just fine it's like a mountain so we say now look three million one two three fifty equal to x is x bracket bracket so this amount we got which equal to sixteen point print thirty seven and then 94 94 94 so we want to get the value fix how we're going to get the value fix divided by 16 and 87 94 87 divide by 16 16 point 37 94 87 this is this cancer 
So x equal to if you put in a calculator, this is gonna give us the this is gonna give us the face option, which is this one here. Let's plug it and see. Plug and see. So cancel, cancel, we come here to the fraction, fraction say three million. Three, three, okay, six hundred fifty, six hundred fifty. And they come at the bottom, divided by sixteen point sixteen. When, when, uh, seven, seven, nine, four, nine, four, four, seven. Oh, the face option. So the face option is going to be the right answer, like I say. So the face option is the right answer. So this is the right answer. Like I say, now let's go to the third question, right? Let's go to the third question quick, quick, and get it done. Okay, okay, uh huh, uh huh. This is the third, third, third question. Let's go. So third question here is say uh third question okay they say run the answer to this question to the nearest range when is South African money but they could have say shillings which is East African money whether using Kenya Tanzania and Uganda and all these East African countries or they could have say uh C D which is Ghanaian money or they could have say Naira which is not uh Nigerian money okay or UK pounds or United States money or Chinese whatever whatever okay now we go so let's say one answer nearest uh, uh nearest range, which is South Africa, man. Let's say David borrowed 90 million. Woo, David, are you gonna be able to pay the money to refurbish his holiday home? Oh, you want to refurbish his home. So he borrowed the money. He borrowed the money. Huh? To refurbish his home. The loan require monthly see monthly, monthly. They already start do monthly thing. Monthly require monthly little payment. Monthly little payment over 12 years. Okay. So time equal to number of years equal to 12 years. Now the interest rate equal to 12.4 per annum. Compounded monthly. It was compounded monthly. So our m equal to 12. I think I explained about the how it was compounded. M equal to 12. Because how many months in one year? It was compounded what? Monthly. They say but five years later, the bank increased the annual interest rate to that one. Woo! Woo! My God. This is what now they say now the interest rate was that one per annum compounded monthly. Okay, but what is the time? Time equal 12. But now they say here, but a five years later, so the loan was supposed to be paid in 12 years. Okay, now the interest rate was that one at this, so we stop here. They compounded what monthly? Okay, now we stop here. But then five years later, the bank increased the annual interest to that one. Okay, five years. Oh, you know what? We're changing right now. We know what years ago, 12, but for the five years, for the first five years, let's call this, let's say, in two. Uh, no, this is in one. For the first five years, let's see, because total years ago, 12. So for the first five years, let's, let's cancel. Let's, let's split this. The interest rate now, it changed. It became what? 13.91%. In a line with the market rates. After five years, the present value of the loan. After five years, the present value of the loan is this. Hey, like I say, hey! Now the video is getting bigger here, but you know, I don't want to make more than 20 minutes. So let me make this question separate because my concern is uh, I, don't, I, don't, I don't like to make a video which is longer than 20 minutes. And it's already 20 minutes. So, hey! Look, hey, I told you, boy. Hey, listen, leave the comments below, like the video, share it to other people. You can check out mobile application. I have a mobile application that I just release, I just the bottle of people. Okay, thanks a lot for time. You can message me, direct me, message me if you want my service. Thanks a lot for your time. Follow me on Instagram, Mtwana, small letter one, underscore Bantu. I'm trying to underscore bank, excuse me. Or you can direct email me, okay? I'm trying to bank to gmail.com only for serious business people. Don't just message me if you know you got nothing to say, okay? Only for serious people, okay? Because, you know, I'm always on time. Like, I got a lot of things going on. Time, time, time. Because of the massive projects that I'm developing or I'm dealing with. Thanks a lot for time for that. I've been saying this is I'm trying to bank to. Easy.